Welcome back to the channel where we simplify technology for you. For this video, I will demonstrate how to use the mean and max function in Google Sheets. Let's get started. Mean returns the minimum value in a numeric data set, while max returns the maximum value in the numeric data set. To use mean and max, they have the same format. You start with the equal sign, followed by the mean function or the max function, and then open and close parentheses. Within the parentheses, you can place uh, several values separated by a comma. Or you can also make use of range of cells. Now, to give you an example, let us refer to this data set. Feel free to get a copy of the sample using the link in the description below. For example, we want to get the highest num the highest sale for the first week. Let's say for the rest for the first week. Okay, so we have Mondays to Saturdays. To get the highest sales, you can easily use the function max, starting with the equal sign and then followed by the command or the function name max, and then open close parentheses. Within the parentheses, you can simply put the values by highlighting the values and then pressing the return key. Now, I will not make use of the same formula for the next row, so I will click X. So you will see when you go back to the cell B10, you will see that it's equal to max B2 colon B7, which represents the range of cells we're in, it will return the maximum or the highest value in the given range of cells. While for the lowest or the mean function, it's similar, which is using the mean function, open and close parentheses, and then you highlight the range of cells. And then you hit the return key and you will get the lowest possible value from the given range. So to simply copy the rest, uh, the, the maximum and the minimum function for weeks two to four, you can simply highlight the two and make use of the autofill and drag it to the right until column E and you will get now the highest and the lowest per week, okay? So that is how you use the mean and max function in Google Sheets. Feel free to comment below if you have any question. Bye for now.